Hello, welcome to the CEW Mindful Meditation video session. My name is Doreen Moroski and I will be leading our session today. Today we're going to focus on what is considered a body scan. And for those of you who are new to practicing with CEW, what I will do is I will guide you um, on a meditation for the first part of the session today. And then I will pause and suggest introduce just a silent portion of our time together. And then I will bring back and have a little bit more guidance before I conclude the set. I will start the set with the sound of the chime one time, and I will be ending it with the sound of the chime three times. And if you're new to the practice, uh, what I recommend is that, and even if you're not for anyone, is that really um, what we're trying to do here is to help train our brains to focus on where we intend our minds to go. Um, as we know, our minds are very active. It's the nature of the mind and often the mind will wander um, into things, times of things that have come before this moment or things that are, have yet to come. And what the practice is really about is trying to help ourselves ground ourselves into this current moment and to accept what we find in this moment without judgment. Um, so that is the skill that we are working on developing. And like any skill, it's a practice. Um, and sometimes we may have an easier time helping focus our mind and sometimes our minds may just continue to wander. Um, so anytime that happens, um, feel like that's noticing that it's, a, it's progress, you're noticing it's happening, and gently with kindness to bring your um, mind back to the source of where you intend it to be. Um, and feel free at any point in time, if my guidance is not helping or working with you, to go ahead and to focus on something else that's grounded for you. Um, and whether that's your breath, sounds in the room, or, or other sensations, know that this is uh, your time to try to be still and practice the art of being present. Um, so with that, we will begin. And what I would suggest to start with is again, to just get as comfortable as you can um, in your seat. And I will go ahead and ring the chime once and invite you just to follow the sensation of the chime. And um, if it's comfortable for you to do so, it's often helpful to either close your eyes or avert your gaze. And that's again, just trying to present, prevent visual stimuli for coming in as you're trying to sort of just ground into the current moment. So with that, let's get started. Taking a moment to just settle in and to know that you have arrived in this moment. And then allowing the body to be as comfortable as possible. If you're sitting, it's helpful to find a posture that is both at ease, but also upright, maybe noticing how your head is sitting on your neck, having the spine erect and yet re relaxed, just signaling the body that I'm here, I'm present. And I'll start our session today with just a short reading from the book called The Mindful Breakthrough by Sarah Silverton, The Wandering Mind. Often as we begin to practice mindfulness, we believe we are doing it wrong if the mind isn't settled on our chosen focus. However, a mind will often conjure up some expectations of how mindfulness is supposed to be. We may expect a calm, still mind and not one that insists on thinking about work or supper or tells us that we have something much more important or even urgent that needs to be done right now. This monkey mind that jumps all around, all over the place, is, however, absolutely normal. 
As you practice mindfulness, you are learning to notice the mind's activity and then gently, but also firmly, return your attention to where you choose. You're not fixing the mind in one place or emptying it. You're just trying to encourage the mind to focus on the source of what you intend it to focus on. So at this moment, what I'd like you to focus on is just to start with breathing and just sensing the, your own breath within your body. And maybe encouraging the body to breathe deeply in and breathe deeply out. And again, with the breath, just breathing deeply in and deeply out, knowing that you've decided to make this the time to practice the art of being present. And now in this moment, allowing the body to just continue to breathe on its own pace and rhythm without needing to control it in any way. Just allowing the body to breathe in and breathe out at the pace and rhythm that is comfortable for you in this moment. As we begin the body scan, let's today begin with focusing our attention with the top of our head. And just noticing whatever sensations are present as we focus our attention on our head. At any point of my guidance, you may or may not notice any particular sensation, and notice that's fine. Just simply allowing a curious mind to explore any source of experience or sensation that may be present. So moving our awareness now to our forehead. And again, noticing any sensation there. It may be a sensation of air as it touches or breezes by our skin. It may be awareness of a tightening or tension within our forehead. What's ever there, just allowing it to be. And if tension's noticed, maybe seeing if it's possible just to let go a little bit in this moment. Moving down now to the brow, the eyebrows and maybe the space between the eyebrows and noticing the sensations there. Maybe gently moving the sensation or the focus of your attention to the eyes. Is it possible in this moment to detect the eyelids that say softly cover the eyeball? Or maybe there's a sense of moisture as the eyeball sits in the socket. Just allowing an exploration of whatever sensation is detectable for you in this moment. 
Maybe moving now down to the nostrils. Maybe detecting the presence of the breath as air flows in and out the nostrils. As the body takes in air, there may be sensations of smell that are present, or maybe not. Knowing that whatever awareness is there is a unique moment of awareness for you. Again, knowing any time the mind has wandered, simply noticing that and then inviting the mind back to the place of your intention. Maybe moving now down to the mouth. Exploring the sensation of the lips. Maybe feeling the lips as they touch one another. Maybe experiencing the inners of the mouth and the tongue as it is placed within the mouth. There may be a sense of moisture or maybe taking a moment to explore the teeth with the tongue in the mouth with a curious awareness of what that sensation is experienced in this body in this moment. Maybe moving the tongue to the roof of the mouth and sensing and doing so if that changes the sensation within the jaw in any way. Exploring the sensation through the jaw and see if it's possible to invite a sense of ease and if the jaw is clenched he be seen if it's possible to let go just a little and inviting that sense of ease within the jaw Be now considering and sensing the whole head as it rests through your neck upon your shoulders. And maybe inviting a little bit of movement and seeing if it's possible to just allow the head to be gently resting on the neck. And moving the awareness now to where the neck meets the body through the shoulder region. This region can often be a sense of tightness and tension for many of us. 
as we may spend much of our day on a device, whether it's a computer or a phone. So if it's comfortable in this moment, maybe offering a little bit of movement, seeing if it's possible to allow the muscles just to let go a little bit and invite a sense of ease through the neck and the shoulder region. Moving the awareness now to our torso, maybe starting with our backs. Again, noticing the sensations present there. If our back or spine is making contact with the chair or the earth beneath us, Notice the sensation. It may be a sense of pressure. Or maybe a sense of temperature. Or maybe there's a sense of texture as the skin is making contact with the clothing upon it. Maybe detecting movement through the back as the body moves air in and out. Now moving our awareness to the front of the body, through the chest and the abdomen region. Just allowing the attention to rest in whatever sensation is present for you through that region. Sensations may be similar or very different from what was experienced with the sensations in the back. Just letting them be as they are. And allowing the mind to host a deep exploration of whatever sensation is present. And now shifting attention to the arms as they are connected to the torso. And following the sense of the arm from the shoulder to the elbow and then to the hand. Maybe being aware of the curvature of the arm. Or the sensations in the hands, wherever they may be resting.
knowing again in this moment, there's nothing your arms or your hands need to do, but just being. and inviting a focused attention on whatever sensations are present in that region of the body. Now inviting your awareness to the rest, to rest its intention and focus on the buttocks behind region. And the awareness of where the legs connect with the upper portion of the body through this region. Maybe sensation again of temperature, of heat, of pressure the points of contact with the earth. If you're sitting, maybe there's awareness of the leg as it bends to the connection through the knees into the shins. a sensation of shape and moving down the leg now to the calves and the shins. Is it possible to experience the calves or the shins from the inside of the body out? Or possibly, if your calves or shins are not covered with clothing, maybe there's a sensation of air on the skin. Or if clothed, a sensation of texture or protection. And now moving the sensations to the experience within the feet. Maybe detecting where the feet connects with the legs through the ankles. And inviting the awareness to extend down to the tip of the toes. Maybe even inviting some movement within the toes and experiencing the sensation that that creates within the feet. The 
feet can be a very sensitive sense region of the body, able to sense all kinds of things. In this moment, just see what's there now. We will now move into a couple of minutes of silent meditation. And I invite you to continue to explore sensations within the body or the breath as an anchor to being here and fully present in this moment. As I move to close our time together in this meditation, just taking a moment to again sense the whole body as it sits or lies in this moment. Maybe taking a moment to appreciate all the things and the wonders of this physical body. Knowing in each moment, it knows what to do without any needs to control the sense of breathing as the breath nourishes the body one breath after another. And knowing in any moment, the body with its breath can help us access a sense of being present in the moment. Anytime we remember to access it. I thank you for taking time to practice this meditation. And we'll now end the practice with sounding the chimes three times. Thank you for joining us.